is about uh, reconstructing the European neighborhood policy, which has actually become very obsolete because of the huge divergences uh, between and within the East European and South Mediterranean groups. Uh, um, at the same time, we observe uh, quietly an alternative, very positive configuration uh, developing. Um, this is uh, based on the increasingly comprehensive set of trade and economic policy instruments across uh, the whole of Europe, bar Russia uh, and its dependents. Um, this is centered on deep free trade, but goes on to include technical standards and a whole long list of, of policies uh, which the paper uh, details. Now putting all of this together um, uh, could be extremely interesting from a strategic point of view. First therefore we give it a name so, no, so everybody knows that it exists. We call it the wider European economic area. Um, this is uh, Europe that would be the wider Europe that would be getting its act together more effectively in the face of Russian and Chinese challenges. Uh, it could also contribute to present efforts to conceive a multi-speed Europe and it could even lead on at some point to a deal uh, with Russia and the Eurasian Economic Union.